Ano ba yung taong may insecurities sa sarili mo? Well, this video is for you. Hi mga katoks! Welcome to J Talks! Isa sa mga worst things that you can do in life, in your life, is to have a war against yourself. Maraming mga tao may World War III sa sarili nila. They have a war inside of them. They hate themselves. Ayaw nila sa sarili nila. And that is not good. They are just focusing on their weaknesses. How they look, how they talk. Um, magaling ba sila mag-aral? Okay ba sila sa pag-aaral nila, sa studies nila? Hindi sila magaling sa any sports, any hobbies. Yung iba nakafocus lang sa mga failures nila like hindi nakapasa sa um, mga entrance exams, hindi nakapasa sa mga interviews and they really feel that they are not worthy. And this is my encouragement for you. Make peace with yourselves. Sabi sa Bible, Jesus said, Love your neighbors as you love yourself. So makikita natin doon if you don't have a healthy respect and love for yourself, How can you love other people? If you can accept yourself, your failures, your strengths, how can you accept other people? Understand this, you cannot give what you don't have. First of all, love yourself. Accept who you are. Know that you are a unique individual. You are talented, you are gifted, and God gave you a specific assignment here on earth na ikaw lang yung makakagawa nun. Remember this, you are not your mistake. Lahat tayo, lahat ng tao nagkakamali pa and lahat tayo binabago pa ni Lord. Alam ni Lord na nagkakamali ka pa and magkakamali ka pa and yet, this is my encouragement for you, God always love you. And lagi kanyang pipiliin, lagi kanyang pipiliing mahalin and lagi kanyang sasamahan sa pagbabago sa buhay mo. Kaya kung si Lord hindi niya tinitingnan yung pagkakamaling mo, ganun ka din dapat sa sarili mo. Forget your mistakes. Accept who you are and know that you are in process. Sabi sa 1 John chapter 4 verse 19, we love God because he first loved us. We love other people because He first loved us. So be secured on His love for you. You are beloved. You are God's beloved. Mahal na mahal ka ng Diyos. Your Father God so loved you that He gave His only begotten Son, Jesus, for you. So first, know that God loves you so much so that you can love yourself and love other people as well. Accept who you are because you are already accepted by God. So that's my encouragement for you today. Always remember Jesus loves you.